before you today as we recognize our 2020-2021 Junior Scholars. The South Carolina Junior Scholars Program was developed by the South Carolina Department of Education during the 1985-86 school year to identify eighth grade students with exceptional academic talent and to develop strategies for inclusion into special programs. Today, we are proud to honor 20 Blackfoot Middle School students that will join the ranks of the South Carolina Junior Scholars. Your recognition as a junior scholar is proof that you have worked hard and you are now among an elite group of scholars. To further commemorate this honor, we look forward to our new junior scholars joining our tradition of personalizing a ceiling towel to be hung in our hallway in honor of you and your accomplishment. Congratulations once again on this major accomplishment. Each of you has certainly distinguished yourself by being among an elite group of students. Good morning, my name is Ethan Kropp and I'm an eighth grader here at Black Middle. And today I'll be introducing our speaker, Dr. Sabrina Suber. Dr. Sabrina Suber is the Executive Director of Secondary Schools for Rickson School District 2. Prior to transitioning to this position, Dr. Suber's administrative experience is preceded by service as a high school English teacher. Her journey as an educator started at Benedict College, where she earned her bachelor's degree in secondary English education. She later received a master's degree in diversion learning from Columbia College and her doctoral degree in educational administration from South Carolina State University. Dr. Suber was named the 2017 Administrator of the Year from the South Carolina Student Council Association, the 2018 Dr. K. Phillips Administrator of the Year Award from the Southern Interscholastic Press Association, the 2019 Magnet Schools of America, of America Region 4 Principal of the Year, the 2019 Magnet Schools of America National Principal of the Year, and the 2020 Richland County Education Association's Administrator of the Year. Her passion is ensuring every Richland School District 2 student will graduate, prepare to be enlisted, enrolled, or enrolled. Dr. Suger and her husband, Brian E. Suger Sr., have three beautiful children. Lauren, the youngest, is a sophomore at the University of South Carolina Upstate. The other two also matriculated through Richland 2 schools and are graduates of Richland Northeast. Brian Jr. in 2010 and Brianna in 2012. Dr. Schubert and her husband have also been blessed with three amazing grandchildren, McKinley Hagen, Bailey, and Marley Schubert. Good morning, Mrs. Mazik, faculty and staff, parents, and most of all, our junior scholars. We stand here today to celebrate your academic achievements. Each of you began middle school excited about moving into the next chapter of your lives. Blythewood Middle School has provided an excellent education, which created an opportunity for you to excel socially and academically. I know this past school year has been very different than anyone ever could have imagined. Who would have thought that in our lifetime, there would be a global pandemic? I definitely did not see this happening. However, what I have always envisioned and believed is that our students possess the academic grit, perseverance, and commitment to make it through challenging times. And that is exactly what each of you demonstrated. In the midst of a global pandemic, you remained focused and committed to your studies. Was it easy? Probably not. Was it nerve wracking? Probably so. But you were willing to trust your teachers and your parents and adapt to the new normal. And for that, we honor you. I want you guys to take the perseverance that is instilled in you and use it as you move on to high school. The grit that each of you possess will certainly be a characteristic that will help you experience success throughout your lives. No matter which high school you attend, I can assure you there are challenges ahead of you. What I'm asking from each of you is to meet those challenges head on with your head held high and your hearts wide open. 
you must try to excel at everything you do. Strive for excellence in every task, whether it's large or small. Accept that it is not enough to simply try to get by in life because that doesn't move our world forward. Understand that your individual accomplishments benefit your school community as a whole because when you succeed, you are showing your classmates that it is possible. When you succeed, you are in a position to give rather than to take. Imagine if every individual lived up to his or her own potential. Think about how amazing that would be and how much better our world would be. My challenge to each of you is to do all that you can to reach your full potential. If, if each of you can do that, just imagine the effect that it would have on our world today. The future is truly in your hands. So please make the most of it. Thank you. And congratulations to the Junior Scholars. Our 2020-2021 Junior Scholars are Sarah Cheney Roy, Ryan Chu, William Coggins, Anna DeBose, Taylor Dykes, Jonathan Edwards, Julian Hunt, Kusa Kazaronian, Taurus Lewis, Ivan Lynn, Lorenzo McLean, Cal Parnell, Carter Phelps, Cody Reed, Porter Romo, Josiah Sands, Benjamin Sears, Olivia Toronto, Nathan Trapp, Maya Venzil. Hello everyone, I am Mrs. Carter, the 8th grade assistant principal, and congratulations, I could not be more proud of our junior scholars. According to brightsparks.com, there are seven qualities of a scholar. Passion, confidence, composure, enthusiasm, the ability to be a team player, analytical skills, and foresight. I can truly say that our BMS Junior Scholars certainly possess all of the aforementioned qualities. As you matriculate through high school, I encourage each of you to continue on your journey towards academic excellence. Again, congratulations on this awesome honor.